Ladies and gentlemen, I'm the NoGuy21 and welcome back to Let's Play Digital Devil Saga. In the last episode, we started our exploration of the Samsara Tunnels. Blech. But hey, at least we're not being bogged down by enemy encounters again stuck in, uh, my, uh, my, bleh, mazes. I was trying to say a combination of the words that didn't make any sense in any context at all. Fantastic start. So, today's objective is to hopefully get to the end of the karma of the Samsara terminals. So many fucking Hindu words gonna make me slur. <sighs> oh well. We'll make do. Alright then, let's uh, head down the ladder and progress. Okay, good. I did remember to put sugar in my coffee. I swear, I am forgetful sometimes where... I put sugar in the coffee, I hear a distraction, I go take care of it, and I come back and I think, wait, did I put sugar in my coffee? And I have to wait until it's cool enough for me to actually take a sip. Just to check. Okay, Chi Blast, let's go. Nice crit. Congratulations, Archilla, you healed yourself. Or rather, you regained MP. Fant what am I even hitting? Nothing is the answer. Not that ain't gonna work. Maybe over here. I mean, if I was sitting back, the controller wouldn't disconnect, but uh, then I would have to, uh... Oh, hey, yellow wall. Oh, hello, body. It's a member of the Brutes. He appears he was brutally maimed. And not eaten. Hello, item. Hello, Mothman. I don't happen to have another, uh, thing, do I? No, I do not. That's unfortunate. Here's some of these guys be stupid. Yes. Yes, you are. Eat rocks. Dom. And Gale gains another level. Alright, what is this? Survey says... Another revival gem. Woo! What about this body? Torn to pieces, then left for dead. Okay, nothing back here. Alright then, so we gotta... <laughs> Ugh. Well, there's nothing like a good sneeze to clear up the sinuses. Well, Argilla got hurt, hit by the curse so far. Who else is getting hit? Only Argilla. I'm okay with this. No crit, unfortunately, which sucks. Okay, I believe we, I am heading in the right direction. 
Knock on wood. Oh great, more of this. There's a terminal up there. Which either means that's the right way to go or not. You guys again? Let's actually do damage to Argilla. No, it does not. That's an interesting uh, quirk. Oh, I think I get why that doesn't why it doesn't hurt her because she's not the one that actually committed the command. Surf did, so he's the one that would take the curse damage. No way. Or is curse only for physical attacks? Oh, fuck me, I don't remember. And I don't feel like testing that one out, so I'm just gonna leave it alone. Dump it all in the luck so we can get some good drops. 40-ish points is good enough for now. The more luck we have, the better my critical rate and drop chance be, be anyway. Oh, hello! Item, what is this? Obtain the forge shot. The forge shot. Is that any better than what we're using? Attack power 120! Yeah, I would say that's good. I would say that's real good. Yeah, I think we're good on bullets for a bit. <laughs> Well, hey, that's a that's a, some money I'm saving. I don't have to upgrade my freaking guns. Got to love the fact that I have uh, increased crit chance. Yeah, I still don't get crits. Oh, look at that! Or an, an organic cell. Right off the bat. Fantastic. And there goes my Astoma Spray. Might as well just use that. Now, when we get to the Brute's base, I won't be using Astoma Spray there because, well, it's a short dungeon, so there's really no need for me to use it. At the very least, I am eventually going to be strong enough for them to just piss off. Okay, let's stop at the terminal so I can get myself another mantra. For Gale. Alright then, Gale, let's get you Fire Lord. Let's see, Heat almost has Mastery of Ice Master. So, he'll be getting a new mantra eventually. Okay, we shall save. Simsara Tunnels E. Okay, well, we're slowly progressing through them. Oh, hi, Race Vilger. I'll screw you. Uh, I know he's weak to freaking electricity. And bullets. This is a waste of MP! Especially when he dodges like a fucking jackass. Hey you, fuck you and your dodge. You fucking prick. Oh, bullshit. Ah, oh, 
fucking jackasses, I swear. Do 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 Wait, what? Let me reread. Let me, uh. Whenever I see strange presence beyond the door, I really should probably heal up a little bit. Strange presence can be felt beyond the door. Open the door? Yes. This is great. All we gotta do is kill them in that crazy dog, dude. Then we win, bro. Won't be a problem. We'll send the other guy later. Send him to our stomachs. Are you fucking. Fucking dare calls. Oh, fuck you, ringtone. Seriously, the only fucking thing that f phone was used for is a goddamn intercom. That's the main reason why we got so many of the damn things. But no, I have to receive the house calls too. Fucking stupid. Okay, so we gotta face off against King Ki, Suki, and Fuki. So where's on Yoki? Is he gonna be a secret boss in this game, or is he just not in it? How much you let me know, boys? Okay, so uh, we want to use fire against Suki, uh, electricity on Fuki, and actually we want to use earth on Kin Ki because he actually has a weakness in this game. Uh, but the thing is, I don't remember if, uh, I really hope Kinky doesn't do anything with electricity. Well, he shields it. Will this actually work? <laughs> Goodbye. Yeah, that's not gonna work. Well, that was easy. I'm really glad that uh, Fuki got feared and was eaten immediately. Later. Another organic cell for the pile. So we are on the right path. Fantastic. Well, if that was true, Gale, why are they fighting us? Because they should know that we're stronger than them. But then again, I don't think Rays have a... A, uh... Big brain, shall we say. Well, actually, just because an animal has a significant amount of intelligence does not mean they're actually smart. There's a difference between having intelligence and having wisdom to use the intelligence. Even the smartest animals, while intelligent, lack human wisdom. There's a reason why humanity is the dominant food chain on the planet. Even with, uh, a lot of dumb fucking sheep. Okay, so I either go forward, left or right. Oh, great. Well, one of these ways leads to treasure, and the other one leads to the forwardness. I like how I try to explain my thought process, and yet I just end up fumbling over my own damn words. <sighs> Everyone loves to laugh at incompetence, I guess. Let's kill the bird. Or not kill the bird. Alright, who you smacking? Everybody! Whew! Race Felger, you're a jackass. Well, pretty soon I'll be strong enough where you won't show up. Power noise, and I just used a freaking Meteorama. <sighs> not gonna waste the fri- I'm not gonna waste the healing. Let's not waste the healing. Oh, 
Oh, Mizuchi. Well, here's how we fix this. Yoinkus. Yoinkus. And die. All right. Woo. Here it is. Here's the place that we that I'm thinking of. You see the hidden uh, hidden uh, pathway behind the life terminal? I miss this every time I come through here. Wow, almost 140. Go behind the secret uh, entrance behind the waterfall. Get rid of the yellow wall. And now we have to go through another water maze in order to get the red key. I might as well get this now since uh, that way I don't have to take multiple trips. Well, I'm gonna have to take multiple trips anyway because there's a freaking optional boss down here I need to unlock. Eh, well, whatever. At least with this I'll have all the keys, I think. Okay, now the solution for this one. Since we have to do multiple things, we actually have uh, 16 turns to do this. Since this one's a lot more complicated. Okay, so the answer for this one is, let's see, south, Go south again. Wee. Okay, so south, south, west. South, south. Oh boy, south again. Because there's only one way to go down here. The current seems to have increased in speed. No shit. Wee! It's a regular water park ride at SeaWorld. Actually, have I ever been to SeaWorld? I know I went to Florida once. Okay, from here we head north. And for one reason alone, we actually need to uh, activate this valve. Opening the valve will release a large quantity of water. Open the valve? Yes. The current has reversed. So now we everything's in the opposite direction. Huh, oh, you think the Asora would learn their lesson in their place? Get out of here, fish food. I was about to say, Qfornius? No, he doesn't want to show up today. Ice wall and rations. Okay. Alright, now that the current has been reversed, we actually need to take... We need to head south again. And this time we head east. The current is gradually picking up speed. East again. Then we head north. And you can see why we couldn't just head north from that block. North again. Then we head back to the east. The sense of foreboding pervades the area. Don't worry, we'll be done here before long. Then we need to head uh, east again. Now our final destination is south. And if I follow this correctly, 
Which I did because we have the long hallway. We made it to our destination. Our reward is... Da 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 da! A red key! Now to get out of here. Wow, I like how I as immediately I end, I get <laughs> thrown into combat. Well, okay then. Time to get out of here. Now, I wonder if I can get to the entrance from here. Okay, so we can't go north. I believe I can get to the entrance from here. That way's a no-go. That way's a no-go. That way's a no-go, too. Yoink. No go. Yeah, I know the current has increased in speed. Can't go that way. But well, I'm literally being pushed in one direction. Ow. Well, at least I'll be put back at the freaking pump room. It's gradually picking up speed. Well, that's fine, because it's going to shoot me out, hopefully, at the other... Hopefully, at the freaking entrance. Really, boys and girls, what do the manta rays think they're going to do? Why are you guys stingrays? Well, it doesn't matter in the long run. You're still fish food. You can turn the fish sticks. Congratulations, CO, your luck has increased. Okay, we go north. Can't go that way. I can go this way. Back here. You're telling me I'm gonna have to uh, reset the water flow, aren't I? If I wanna if I wanted to do this in one cycle. Is that what you're telling me, game? Is that what you're telling me, that I had to reverse the uh, water flow in order to get back without uh, wasting time? Because so, I'm not surprised. Well, I better reset the water flow anyway. We have the advantage. Proceed. Because here's hoping actually resetting the water flow actually sends me to the entrance and not the other way. I swear to god, if I get sent back to the thing after I reverse the water flow, I'm gonna be jacked. But hopefully the game is nice enough to not soft lock me. I mean I could test it. Where I uh Oh, screw it. I'm not gonna risking softlock for my own curiosity. Alright, where are you spitting me out? A large quantity of water surging in this direction. Okay, so where'd you spit me out? Return to the entrance. Well, that doesn't help. Okay, good. Good. Whew. That works for me. Well, now that we have the red key, I guess I could teleport back to the entrance of the dungeon and do that uh, red door. If I want to. And... Great, I get ambushed by the worst possible combination to get ambushed by. Fantastic. 
Fuck all y'all. I am actually okay with this. Hey, Gail, you want to be uh, smart and uh, don't do anything besides take a panacea? Sure. Why not? Have our Jill Waster turn do this. Attack failed. Just say dodge, goddammit. Make my self esteem feel better. Get out of here, you shit lord. Okay, annoying jackass taken care of. Now to get rid of the others. Ow. You, sir, are a prick. Dekarabia, get out of here. It's a good thing there's a heal shrine right here, otherwise I'd be annoyed. And we're back to up to 150. Alright, let's progress. Ah, we're at this part. So yeah, I am getting close to the end. Fantastic. And now we gotta deal with the ugliest demon in the game. That makes that noise. Say hi to Tang Key, ladies and gentlemen. The ugliest son of a bitch you'll ever see. Alright, you disgusting uh, mockery of Tarask. What the fuck are you weak to? Because I forget. You're weak to Earth. You're level 42. And Arjula is stunned. Screw you! I hope you're prepared to hear that every time this thing moves. Good God, I hate that guy. Well, might as well get rid of the stun. Alright, everyone's healed back up to full. And we gotta slowly wait for Surf to finish climbing a ladder. Yeah, no problem, Surf. It's not like we haven't got time on our hands. No, you could just take as long as you want to climb up a fucking ladder. Oh, Grace, he's focusing. And I don't have anything to do. But hey, jackass! Go ahead. Take your shot. I guarantee if you do, you will die like the bitch that you are. Idiot! Stupid bird brain. Get in the stomach! Man, am I hyper aggressive against the fucking enemies today? Death blow, power charge, void physical. Now, if only that was a passive instead. What's going on? No, don't. Ah! And he's dead. Yeah, I think it's safe to say that, uh... That our buddy, uh... 
Aha! Here's the karma terminal, and there's the exit! So we did make it to the end of Samsara Tunnels today. Fantastic! Restore. We are going to save. Because if we progress forward, we're going to have to fight off against the boss. A.K.A. Lupa. Okay, we made it to Samsara Tunnels 3. Fantastic! And all the bodies are just strewn about. It's a member of the Brutes. He has been mutilated his entrails are gnarled. Ugh. Talk about a gruesome fate. Okay, so the item's already in effect. Okay. It's one of the wolves. There's a gaping hole where his throat should be. Yep, I think Lupa has gone berserk. His juggler is torn open. There's something in his hand. Take it? Sure. Obtain two rations. This is a member of the wolves. He's been mauled to death and his entrails are devoured. Well, time to prepare for a boss fight. Okay, uh, first off, combos. What do I need for Takaja and Dakunda game? So I'm going to need those. Two Unda skills, and two Kaja skills for both of these. Okay, that's easy enough to get. Okay, set. Am I going to need Bufudine or Ma Bufudine? Actually, we're gonna go with Bufudine, actually. Okay, so since we're going up against a boss fight, we're gonna... It's time to increase... the damage. Okay, we're gonna get rid of fir fire first strike and replace it with fire boost. Gonna get fire resist, because otherwise, uh, we're gonna have some problems. Uh, keep the critical. AP device not gonna do anything for us. Okay. In that case, we're gonna get we're gonna swap out Chi Blast and Ingest. What's Death Blow? Moderate damage, physical curse, okay. But I need physical target. Ailment's gonna do jack fucking squat. Skull cleave it is. Need these open. Okay, for ingest, we're gonna swap that out for da 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 da, da. with Tarunda instead. Okay. Surface set. Gale. We don't need chakra walk for this. You don't have Bufudine, so that's a that's a no-go. That would be useful, but Gonna get Rakunda over Mazeodine. Argilla Let's see, we still have the We still need a Kaja spell, so you're gonna give me Uh Makakaj is going to help out a lot with Surf's, uh, thing. So we'll do that. Uh, we don't need, uh, Maypotra for this. Where didn't I... You don't have... Oh. You don't have the, uh... Boost for AP. You don't have Atma bonus. Ideally, I want Heat in the party, since he and Surf both have, uh... Atma bonus, so we get more AP from fights. Honestly, I need to, I need to, blah, blah, blah. What I need to do is some fucking farming. Uh, but I'll do that later. Honestly, what, what I need to do is just, yeah, just do massive amounts of farming so people can have mantras. Anyway. 
Let me just double check. Everything's right. That's right. That's right. So, okay. So we should be good for this boss. Let's roll. Is a member of the Brutes. His juggler is torn open. And watch me get attacked by a random encounter before the boss. This must be it. Time to face off against Cerberus! Lupa and Bat are the only uh, main bosses that do not have Hindu-inspired names. I wonder if there's a reason for that. Well, anyway, the main gimmick here is that uh, we have three targets. The right head, the center head, and the left head. The right head's the most annoying because he will buff and debuff and heal. The center head does, uh, I believe he does physical attacks, as well as uh, a combo fire spell attack, which is annoying. And I forget uh, what the left head does, but I don't think it matters as long as this as long as this head go goes first. Which is why we have Takaja and Takunda as combo spells. So, first things first. Oh yeah, I should probably say what he's resistant to. Cerberus here uh, drains fire, obviously. Nullifies spell, death, and ailments as always. A strong versus electricity, force, and earth. So, any magic spell is that's only going to affect him is ice. You'd think he'd be weak to ice, but he's not weak to ice. Which is asinine. Oh yeah, I also believe this guy has counter, so having to ruin it is actually a good idea. So let's, uh... Let's do a couple of rounds of debuffing and buffing first. Well, that's asininely stupid. Oh wait, it's the left head that heals. I forgot. <sighs> I'm okay with this. Agiela was easy to deal with. Oh no, you're healing. I feel so bad. Still doing 189 damage, buddy. You missed, bitch. Just gonna keep doing this. Let's get another Makakaja off. Because he, he's either gonna do Takunda or Takaja. One of the two. Or debuff me. That works too. Ow. Oh no, you healed him for 250. Let's we'll see how much damage I do. 272. I output. I do better than your healing. So therefore, you lose. Ow.
Well, uh... I did not mean to double pass. Gale might die because of that. Makakaja. Yeah, Gale died because of my stupidity. That's great. Well, there goes the head. Well, I guess we're doing a revival gem strat. After I heal myself. Ow. Well, at the very least, this guy can no longer do any stupid shit. Well, first revival gem use of the game. Now, here's the thing, though. Here's the thing. I can now freely do this without worrying about a damn thing. Ow. Crit still hurts. Oh yeah, you can cast Mahama. Power charge, huh? Well, see, you can't do a combo attack, so... Get rid of your buffs, just in case you have any. And I'm gonna put up attack wall just so I can see you uh, blast yourself in the face. Idiot. Well, might as well make sure you hit like a freaking kitten. And uh, fully decrease your defense. Oh yeah, I forgot you can still do that even with one even with two heads. Okay, I think that's the limit. Well, let's see how much should we do with Skull Cleave. 362. You missed. Well, Surf's gonna be busy tearing you to a new shred. Might as well max out our speed and agility. So yeah, once we get rid of the head that does buffs and debuffs, Cerberus is an easy fight. Dodge, bitch. Now, it's a good thing I don't have Taru Kaja, otherwise this would have gone way quicker. Gotta give this guy a chance to actually, you know, show off his moves. I don't want to just curve something my way through a boss fight. I want to be challenged. Yeah, I thought so. I knew you had Counter-Strike. Wow, oh, you can still hit me. Impressive. Wait, are you healing yourself or the middle head? Because you're healing the middle head, that's dumb. And then there was one. And I believe that's four. I literally got no other option but to do physical attacks. Ooh, Psycho Rage. Power Charge. Ow. Agudine, huh? Well, I'm just gonna do this so you uh, stop being a bitch. We gotta pass so we can do this. Do this again. Okay, good. Gate of Hell. Well, if that was supposed to do something, it did nothing. Now we will just sit here and uh, basically do mass spam of physical attacks. And have Argila heal if we need to. I'm curious, how much damage will Poofudine do to you? Uh, 
Ah, the middle head must be, uh, resists the physical. <laughs> that explains a fair bit, actually. Um, do I have an ice gem by chance? We got one. Okay, we got Frost Bomb. That's better. Well, good news, he's almost dead. Uh. No fire? I mean, I'm never gonna use it, so might as well. Wow, impressive uh, attack there, pal. Very impressive attack. All right, this next attack should end him, or at least this round, I should say. Later, Cerberus. And of course, we don't eat him for some damn reason, but we gain a lot of experience from it. And a great chakra. Level up! Put in the look. You can't fight the hunger forever. Once it takes over, nobody can help you anymore. That's why God said, this cycle of sadness must not continue. But I... 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 <laughs> Please... Devour me. Lupa, what shall I tell your child? Tell him. Does not die with you. I will find your son. Surely regret giving me this cursed power! Well, congratulations, Gail. You finally got your emotions back. <laughs> oh. oh, my legs. And all it took was for you to uh, swear to find someone's son and... Yeah, okay. I'm not gonna p piss on the uh, parade. One day that building suddenly sprang out of nowhere. The colonel took a scouting party inside and it's been our base ever since. When he found the outermost room, the colonel flew into a rage. Please, I'm getting information. Don't devour me. We didn't anticipate a cowardly ambush because we assumed our enemies were true soldiers. If we knew to think like cowards, you would be prisoners by now. Oh, you mean smart? Ruling by power is effective until people refuse to acknowledge that power. In us, the Karma Temple has engineered its own demise. Well, it made it to uh, Ajna. At least I think I was pronouncing that right. Now, the downside is we can't actually leave here until... Well, technically we can leave. Until we beat the brute space and unlock this fucking gate. The door is tightly shut. 
So if we want to leave to resupply at a vendor, we actually need to head back into the Samsara tunnels and go out the other side. And traverse back through Svadistana. So yeah, it's a long run back as you want to gain access to a shop. Fortunately, there's a large karma terminal right here outside the building. Well, might as well uh, see what we got. Let's see. Oh boy. Might as well get this. See, heat is almost uh, fully mastered. That CL is almost mastered. Six realms. All right. Well, I guess we'll save. That boss fight only took me about ten minutes, give or take. I don't think anything surprises me anymore. Look at that building, seen it before, haven't you? Well, I can't exactly see it from here. Oh yeah, I forgot there's a vendor here. Why am I so stupid? Oh, that's right, because I usually just run past it and I even notice the freaking golden symbol on the wall. That's why. No one can avoid the fate which reigns from the heavens. The only thing I can do is pray. He has already been overtaken by the virus. He had been or has already been? Okay, had been taken. That's Varen's headquarters? Serve, isn't that? Varen Omega is dangerous. He must not be allowed to reach Nirvana. Well, that's real specific. But hey! My dumbass forgot this shop even existed, so I can't complain that much. The worst part is, noises don't even sell for a lot, so even if you hoard these and, uh... Don't need them anymore. You can't really sell them for much. See, what's the moon phase at? Half. Is it going up or down? It's going down. Great. We're going to be running around for a few more minutes then. Meanwhile, we're busy looking at these, uh, attack vehicles. It's not technically a tank, is it? Uh... Wait, they're running. Well, there goes the anti-demon field. Why the hell are these vehicles turned on? Well, well, that one is. Oh, my favorite. Running around just so I can get more cash. Oh well, at least we're done with the freaking Samsara tunnels for now and I never have to go back there for a while. It's great! On the plus side, after this dungeon is over, I can actually start doing optional bosses. Hooray! Because, ladies and gentlemen, this is the second to last dungeon of the game. I wasn't kidding when I said Digital Devil Saga is short. Because after we defeat Colonel Beck, it's just straight to the end dungeon. Alright, let's sell this. I like how I make all my money back. Yeah! Once you start getting sells to drop like candy, your money problems go away. Let's see, is there anything else I could sell for a large sum of cash? Or things I don't need? Not really. Yeah, I got that for... Yeah, that's an easy 50 grand I didn't need to buy. Fantastic. Um, do I want to stock up with some more Astoma Spray? Well, first of all, let's see if the shop has, uh, added inventory. No, it has not. In that case, uh, we're gonna buy... Well, let's restock on a Stoma Spray. Even though I'm not going to use it. Might as well, uh, buy some Chakra Drops. Let's buy some Medical Kits. 
buy some brave rations. And I might as well buy five of each, uh, elemental item. Just for coverage, if nothing else. Because if an enemy is weak to an, to an elemental I don't have equipped at the moment, it's kind of annoying. So I might as well do this now. Is there anything else I need to get? Uh, I mean, I could start start stocking up a chakra pots. Though I kind of wish I could buy soma drops instead, but uh, actually, let's just uh wait on that for front for a moment. All right, then. I think that's enough uh, wasting time. Ladies and gentlemen, I've been NoGuy21. This has been Let's Play Digital Devil Saga. Might as well save so I don't have to go through the shopping again. In the next episode, we enter the brute space of operations. Which is going to be a fun place. I can already know, tell and know. But until then, thank you for watching. Have a wonderful evening, and I'll see you all next time. The downside of me using a Stoma Spray and the, uh, Samsara Tunnels, we didn't get to meet the infamous enemy in there. Because, uh, it's a special encounter that's very weaker than the party. So Stoma Spray stops it from showing up, which is, um, kind of annoying. But hey, it'll do.